Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. This idiot Zelensky uh, plans to visit Israel. Such a weasel, uh, and I will tell you why. Uh, I met this kind of people who show up in your life when you are either at the lowest point or at your highest point. Why? Because they know that that's where they have the most influence. Why? When you're at the lowest point, they come and they try to show empathy and then you're inclined to say oh that's actually he's not such an asshole he's a nice guy actually and then you end up fucking that guy for instance uh this happened uh, <laughs> i saw that many occasions in my life when you know you had a girl you know let's say she got, had a breakup with her boyfriend or something not something with a boyfriend and then the big wolf shows up and oh you can you can talk to me you can tell me you can trust me and then they end up I know uh, doing that anyway that's one at the lowest point but not only that when you have tragedies in your life you know you're you're so exhausted that you accept people that you don't probably talk to them you haven't talked to them for, for years they come back and try to access you know, access you and hey um how are you i'm sorry and you're more inclined to say yeah it's okay and think well you see when i was in a deep shit you know he came and said that no he just wants to get back to fuck you up that's what they want and when you're at the top of the world they again they try to come because you're ecstatic you're happy about it and when you're happy about things you are you tend to be more more giving more forgiving more yeah it's okay man yeah you can come yeah man i'm sorry let's let, let's give, give me a hug and so on so both extremes you have weasels who show up to take advantage that's exactly what this motherfucker wants to do now, I don't think, I don't think for a second that he is uh, really interested in his people to go over there and say, hey, my fellow Jewish population, people, my Israelis, I loved you so much and uh, I'm the president of the Ukrainians, but, you know, I love you and I'm here to support you because I love, love you. I don't think that is. I think he wants weapons to go and fuck the Russians up in the country of Ukraine, of the Ukrainian nation, at the orders of Al Capone. So let's stop pretending bullshit here. This is the guy with the Ukrainian flag. Shut the fuck up. The office of the president of, the, of, of Ukraine has sent a formal request for the Israeli government to approve an official visit to the country by Zelensky. Why? You were not invited to invite yourself again. It's gonna look good, right? Shut the hell. Is. So Axios quoted, quoting Sources from Ukrainian and Israeli governments, as reported by European Pravda. Axios sources reported that Zelensky's office has sent an official request to the Prime Minister of Israel to approve an official visit. The talks on the visit are preliminary and the exact date has not been approved yet. The purpose of Zelensky's visit, I just told you, is to show solidarity with Israel, which suffered a bababab. -ba -ba. Earlier in Brussels, where he was attending a meeting of the Ukrainian Defense Contact Group, Zelensky called on other leaders to visit Israel to show solidarity. My man, let me, let me tell you this garbage here. Israel and what's going on over there is not important for many, for a majority on this planet. Don't push that, but they do. That's not that important. There are many other things for me that are more important than that. Like, for instance, the milk got to $3.19 today. $3.19. I went to buy a gallon of milk. I'm crying about it. Why? Because under the, the orange man, bad guy, remember? Not Putin, but uh, Trump. The gallon of, of milk was 89, not dollars, cents a gallon. So from 89 in, two, in 2020, from 89 cents, now it's 319.99. So it's 320. So from 90 cents, you're like 320 right now. In what? In two years and a half? And you tell me, or you tell me that's fantastic here? Or three years? Not even three years. Two years and a half. And you tell me the the, the inflation is under control, is just 5%. The inflation, I think, is 29% of things on things that I care for. So I care about that more than the Israel. Israel, with Israelis, they can do that. They have their guys in the Senate, in the, in the State Department, they have in the House of Representatives, in the Pentagon, they have in intelligence services. They have their boys over there. So, I mean, I'm, they don't need me. They need my taxes. It's all they fucking need. My taxes and keep my mouth shut. Well, I'm not a good listener. 
uh, regarding the second one. But anyway, and the first one too. I pay my taxes and I talk too much. Not talk too much, actually. I talk a little bit uh, above the, 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 the average, I would say, the way I see it. Well, obviously, I'm, I'm subjective, but in a uh, vibrant, dynamic democracy and free world, what I'm doing right here, this should be a little bit above 50%. Let's, pay, let's say about 60%. Okay, Everything else I do that you don't see, now that can get you to 100%, but it's a different story. So anyway, yeah, come over and yeah, like, like everybody was coming to Kiev to do what? They were taking all these leaders, taking to this uh, theme park, Bucha. I'm sorry, but that's the way they used it. They used it as a theme park where they would bring the, the, the leaders and say, oh, see, oh, see, oh, see. Uh -uh, okay, now, money. Give me the money. If not, this is because of you. And if you don't give me the money, more like this will happen because of you and your people. You know what? I would have done. Fuck you. Bang. But no, they were like, <laughs> your leaders, my leaders. If there would be democracy, we would not have this kind of uh, garbage in charge of us. <sighs> yeah, so uh, go over there and show solidarity. Maybe I show solidarity with the wrong people. How about that, Zelensky? No, 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 you can't. You have to show it. We, we see who's right and who's wrong. No. No, I don't subscribe with, uh, to your assessment. The same with Ukraine. Oh, the Russians attacked unprovoked. No, I don't think so. I don't think so whatsoever. When someone kills your people and you intervene, what do you do? Like Israel, you hit back. Oh, no, it's not the same thing? Okay, got it. All right, thank you very much. <laughs> Zelensky. So I think Zelensky goes over there as a show, as a political move. And because uh, at this point, uh, Israel, it's at a low, you know, was attacked. And now this guy shows us, I'm going to show solidarity, baby doll. <laughs> when are we going to fuck? Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just.